this is the idea that the act of Russian warfare that comes next will be invading our homes via our kettles. Mm. Yes, the, the hackers use your kettle's default password to take control of it and your press... Kettle, hang on, your kettle has a default, default password? password. <laughs> I mean, your kettle probably doesn't. My kettle doesn't, know. no. But if you have a smart kettle... A smart kettle? Oh. Yes, you can boil water from another room. Can you boil a kettle in somebody else's house without their permission? Yes. Yeah. Well, that's how Putin could launch an invasion. All yeah. our kettles could yeah. spontaneously start boiling. Everybody rushes to make a cup of tea and he's coming across the straight to Dover. Straight yeah. in. <laughs> but you're you joking, but... They, they... I mean, this is, this is <laughs> happening. No, it's not really happening, Ian. Yes. Isn't it? But, well, the kettle now. thing, that was just... I made that up. <laughs> no, you see, you didn't make it up. They can I take over the up. kettle via the password and press gang the kettle into a botnet. The enslaved device then lures others into the botnet and they're all told to make endless requests from what? the same server, causing it to overload and crash. Yeah, this did happen last week. There was, there was a crash when all sorts of bits of the internet were unavailable and fell apart after they were hacked into it. It made mm. a huge difference to my life. <laughs> I couldn't get on Twitter, Instagram, I was taking pictures of my lunch. <laughs> <laughs> To get a new car instead of your regular <laughs> handsome cab. <laughs> Not just kettles. I mean, what else? What are other bridges? Toasters. Yes. Toasters are the worst. Electric can openers. Toasters are the worst. Webcams, baby monitors, printers, routers. You must have some of these things. But I have a baby monitor, yes. But that's kind of was a foolish purchase, really, because I don't have any children. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't are we protected by the fact that we've got very slow broadband? <laughs> should we not be worried about Russia's aggressive posturing, according to Professor Mark Armand? Um, they're... they're, they're uh, <laughs> somebody <laughs> hacks into you. Yeah. <laughs> Mr Putin has a reasonable regard for... <laughs> <laughs>